A section of clergy from Kajedo County has reached out to the political class to promote national cohesion for the country's stability. Elsa, a section of Kenya Kwanza leaders, has urged opposition leader Raila Odinga to give dialogue a chance and desist from threatening of street protests should it fail. Details of this and other stories in politics at one. Speaking at Loy Talk Talk in Kajedo County during the Orthodox Church consecration ceremony, Bishop David Palumwati said national cohesion will be the first facet towards rebuilding the ailing economy. He reached out to politicians to give the bipartisan talks a chance and desist from utterances that might bring more divisions. Meanwhile, a section of Kenya Kwanzaa leaders are calling on the opposition leader, Raila Odinga, to give dialogue a chance. Let's give dialogue a chance. We are tired with maandamano as the youth to support this nation, support through ideas, not supporting it through blackmail to, to get your personal means. And hundreds of Kikuyu elders are led to Kiama Kiama from Mount Kenya have made a declaration to appoint the deputy president regarding Gishagwa as the Mount Kenya kingpin. Speaking during the installation of one of their patrons for Kiama Kiama in Kiambu sub-county, Thomas Kamau Kumari, the elders urged elected leaders from the region to support the deputy president. Yule atakayo kutuongoza kwa kutuonyesha barabara ya yale tutaenda ni Ligadhi Gashagwa our deputy president. Kwa hivyo ni muhimu sana vile tumerudisha kiama mahali ilikuwa ili tuweze kuleta vijana na wasee pamoja. And a section of Azimio coalition leaders led by DAP party leader Eugene Mwamalwa have vowed to gather sufficient evidence on police brutality during the anti-government protest. Speaking when they visited families of youth who were shot during the protest, the leaders led by Eugene Omalwa noted that they will ensure they hold the government accountable. postmortem report, tunataka ile evidence ambayo tulikuwa nayo, tuko na team ya mawakili. Separately, a section of Azimio coalition leaders is now claiming that the arrest of former Kakamega Governor Whitecliffe Oparanya follows his announcement that he will vie for presidency in the next election. Mbaka wakanipa hizo simu za watoto ni kaenda nazo. Siku shikwa. Nataka ni seme ukweli. And finally, the National Council of Churches in Kenya, NCCK, is urging the government to address certain constitutional challenges that have arisen since the promulgation. Political rhetoric continues to threaten peace and security of the citizens.